Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you how to install this bullhorn red. I purchased mine from vitalxl.com. It was about $42. It looks like this. The horn here is made out of metal. This part's metal. It comes with a metal bracket and a housing which is plastic. Okay, so I'm installing this in a Ford E350. It's already been slightly modified to have a towing package. For this installation, I used everything you see here. A crawler, lots of tools, metric drill bit, some cutters, electrical stuff, drill driver, scissors. You'll also need a sense of humor in about three hours. So the first hour and a half of this was figuring out how to route this. And watching this video is going to save you time and money. First I had to take off this grill. There's a screw here in the middle. And then there are Christmas trees you can pull out in four places. Then you lift this back a little bit. And then you push down on tabs in three locations across the front. Here, here, and here. Perhaps there. And that allowed me access to install the horn. So what I did for this installation was I removed something holding up the hood release, which was that. I've relocated it to there. And I removed it and installed the bracket right there. You can see the bolt and nut I used. All I did was simply bend the bracket to fit my angle. And then I installed a wire. I ran it over here to the distribution box. I already had a 25 amp fuse. I spliced it into the fuse there. That runs from the positive terminal here. Now, for the control cable, as you can see, it runs right here. My cable runs up underneath this crossbar. And then it comes out here. underneath here and then it runs all the way back underneath the air intake past some hydraulic lines I'll show you where it comes out the other side it's all the arm right here where it was easily accessible but not too much in the way and I drilled a hole next to the removable interior cowling the seal through the metal right there and i installed the cable straight into that i didn't put any tie downs or anything to the cable because the shaft here is fairly sturdy you can take this apart here and adjust it I had to cut about two feet off of the cable. And when you're done, it should sound a little bit like this. And that is the bullhorn. And that is how you make a cow sound like a cow in the cow van. Bye. <laughs>